some um, hives. They're actually welting up on Jim. It just comes out out of the blue, trying to figure out what's creating it and causing it. And you can see the blanching, they're so tight. Um, so what we've been doing for these, they're very itchy. They just come up out of, out of nowhere. So Jim's been putting um, on these hives, he's been putting lavender, let me just put it right here, essential oil, and then he's been rubbing some deep blue on, trying to get rid of the, the redness and the itching. It seems to help. He's also been trying to take in uh, deep blue polyphenol capsules to help with inflammation. And, um, and of course, triese, which is lemon, lavender, and peppermint. So just one more video of the, the welts and wheels. Yeah, and they're random. They're on his chest, they're on his arms. You can see how, how blanched they are right now because so it's so inflamed. Uh, it does go away, but it just comes up. We're not sure if it's stress, cold stress, heat stress. Who knows? <laughs> um, but as most of you know, Jim has had non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. Still healing from it, almost clear. Um, is but is this effect? a side effect of that? We're not sure, but we're, we're using essential oils at this time to, uh, and doTERRA to take care of it. Um, may need to do a little bit more. This is where I talked about in my last video is you can take care of things topically and internally for a little while, but then you still may need to go see your physician. So remember that. Um, but right now we can manage, you know, these oils also replace Claritin and um, those over-the-counter meds. So we're doing that for now, and then probably we'll go see his uh, primary care to see if there's something else we can do. It may just be all cancer-related. So that's it. Thank you for watching. Bye.